And I have to deal with the notepad too. Come on, flip up! Ah! Hello everyone, it is me, Jer Gaming here, and welcome to if I can actually pronounce this correctly now, um Oblictus Casa. I guarantee you I probably still said that wrong. So um yeah, I'm back to this game. After a, a month or more, if you guys actually didn't know, I recorded the uh, first part actually uh, all the way back in the December, and now it's January, I think it's the 3rd. Yeah, because it says it on my uh, thing down there. If I said her name, she would activate. But yeah, January 3rd, and I think the last time I recorded this was like, I don't know, it was like early December, but uh, we're just going to get back into it. <sighs> back to these darn tunnels. Also, shout out to uh, Mr. Homie Besco. I'm going to try uh, doing exactly what I was thinking about doing earlier. And that was uh, avoiding using the torch. At least as much as possible. I'm looking out for the chime sound effect. So I'm going to be doing a little bit of walking. I'm going to see just what happens if I avoid using it. Chiming. We're just going to see what happens if I avoid doing the torch. Dang, why is this so difficult? I'm just trying to listen for some chime sound effect. But I can't tell if it's close or near. I could just barely make out where I'm looking. It's very hard to see, but... <gasps> oh, wow, just like that. Just like that. I can't believe using the not using the torch strategy actually worked. That's crazy. Holy cow. You cannot let her into your room. Use the flash. Let who? There's oh, there he is, or there she is. So who am I trying to make sure doesn't come to my room? Is it just her? I'm assuming Daisy. Huzzah. What is that? Oh, that thing almost formed. You cannot let her into your room use the flash. How do I do that? Is it the camera flash I'm assuming? I'm coming, I'm coming. I'll tend to your needs. Oh, I never even saw him there before. What the heck? Okay. Really now? So that's what she does. Okay, good to know. Oh, <gasps> she disabled my camera? I thought that was. I thought. Is it just disabled forever now? Where'd she go? Well, oh, there she is. <sighs> what do I. So, how close does she need to be until I can start flashing her? Oh, just like that? There he is, get back. Okay, so now we at least know what happens when, uh, what is it? Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I'm kind of treating her the way I'm treating Willie. Just uh, the exception being that it's with the cameras now, camera flashing. Okay. Along with her. 
Is that like a photo negative mini or something? Cause she's photo negative, but just you know, looking kind of like mini. I hope I didn't really miss anything. I'm waiting for a. Uh... Yep, that. I'm waiting for that. I uh, where is he? Where is he? Where is that little rascal? Give me. You want a hug? I'm not giving you a hug today, bro. You should have asked for one when you didn't look like that, you know? Is it your hat? I thought it was my hat for a second. Whoo, that was close. <laughs> that didn't recharge the time. Oh my goodness, that could have been dangerous. Dangerous. My goodness, how many times do I have to flash you, ma'am? Probably should not have went up here since he's not even up here. Jeez, that thing is very friskety briskety. And then this thing keeps growing even bigger. I don't even know what it is, what it's about, what it even... And that's the face, that's homeboy, homebro. Okay, 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 okay. This is already really difficult. There's only like four enemies to deal with. That's her. Okay, there we go. So, is that Daisy Head the thing that just wanders around the building, or...? Or does she, like, occasionally get closer? Because, uh... I'm seeing her constantly warping around some cameras. Yeah, like that one, for example. So, what's the thing with her? Where? Wait, where did... Where are you? Oh my gosh, she got some ugly looking teeth. Alright, erase this, come on. Where is she? Oh, there you are, it's kind of close. What if I just do that? What's she gonna do? What if I just keep the camera down? I'm not very nice. Excuse me, have you looked in the mirror, sir? I, I guess it makes sense Daisy took offense to that, because <laughs> just made fun of one of her friends. The morning sun has driven them back into dankness. I like me some dankness. Okay. Let's see. Where to go? Using the not using the torch strat works. That's crazy. Once again, even though I already thought about that, shouts to uh, my homie Besco for that. Someone new is in the attic. He does not like the light. Leave him alone. The music will work on the creature that comes to your window. What? I'll take that as I wasn't supposed to do that. Oh, what the frick? What am I doing now? Why is there a, a, a number thing up there? Oh, now I can get a better look at whatever that is. What 
is that? What even is this place? Do I not do it on the bunny? Is do I not do it on Oswald? Is that why he keeps killing me? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, night four is gonna be a doozy as I got killed really quickly and it wasn't even 1 a.m. Why am I even in this cabin? Okay, someone new is in the attic. If he's there, don't light him. The music will work on the creature that comes to your window. So basically, Whoever, th that, that's definitely Goofy. That's just a weird looking version of Goofy. Whatever he is, he just can't come to my window. So, I'm assuming the closest they can get is, um, there. Hey! I tried turning off my torch. Oh my gosh, why do I keep coming back here? I can't even win this. Oh, thanks, little Mickey Mouse. What even? What is this place? Wait, why is this so dark? Hello? <gasps> How do you win that? Okay, what's fast mode? I'm a little bit curious on that. Am I a, do I make the assumption it just makes my game move faster? Do I go up the attic faster? Do things happen? What the frick? The look of the game just changed to this incredibly weird picture. So is fast forward literally just optimized version of the game? What if I try pointing my thing away from him? Now it's the other one. Oh my gosh, I'm back here again. Oh, I'm looking for Mickey Mouse things? Okay. So, what do I do to win against that thing? That just comes into my room and kills me because she's lacking. Alright, so fast mode is just optimized mode, aka ugly mode, so let's not do that. So I'm assuming from seeing one of them, I think it was Peter that was the guy that killed me. Can I make the assumption that flip the camera down, bro? Holy cow. Maybe I need to up the sensitivity up my mouse again. Yeah, that's what I thought. So what if I just turn over here? Why does this thing keep Getting worse. Shut the frick up. I try to be as nice as possible, bro. Apparently your way of not being nice is to goof me up. Jeez Louise. Is that Peter or is that... Yeah, it is. So what, do I just not go up there? Gosh, dang bro, what? I don't get it. For once, I actually won that thing. So is that what happens when I win? I'm just back, and it's really dark and grainy for some reason. That thing looks so ugly. <laughs> Dang, I don't know how they did it. How did you make Goofy look that incredibly hideous? 
Okay, is that the face? Okay, so is there a sound effect difference is what I'm getting at. <sighs> That's the one I should ignore. I don't really seem to have a good way of keeping them locked. That's the one I should ignore, I think. So they make the same sound effect? How do you even check? When do, if I just CP, do I just book it immediately? I don't even think I can do that. Yeah, see, I can't even book it immediately. So if I, if I just saw him, I'm just screwed. So what, do I just guess? Can I just turn the thing off the moment I see him? No, I can't even- I- I'm just screwed! I don't get it! What am I supposed to do? Do I have to assume they're playing some sort of game of... See, like, who's that? Is that him? Or is that, like, the face? I wouldn't be able to tell because they make the same sound effect. I'm gonna have to assume it's Peter. Okay, now is that the face? I don't understand. How do you know? What do you do? So you just back out immediately? I can't even do that. Maybe I'm not understanding the fact that there is a window of dodging him. Maybe that's why. Cause I will admit there was a brief window he does give me where I can dodge him, but maybe I'm just making the assumption that's not the case. So, wow, off the gate, all right. So what do we call this guy? Cause I think, uh, what is it? Goofy in Treasure Island was named a Cephalus, I think? So, what about, uh... Okay, we're also looking for that sound effect too, I guess. So if I listen for the brrrr sound effect, and I'm there, then I guess, uh... Yeah. Oh. Wow, twice in a row. Whoa! Blah, can you explain to me what that was? What just killed me? What was that? <laughs> what was that? What? Was that like a, a rare enemy? Was that like a golden photo negative Mickey or something? What was that about? 
Dude. Oh my. I'm gonna. I need a break from that. That. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 15 minutes later. All right. I'm back, and I also readjusted my microphone a little bit because I didn't even realize I was so loud. So, um, yeah, let's uh, let's do that again. I'm assuming I just got killed by something that was supposed to be rare, and nothing else, cause, oh my gosh, that was after just figuring out what to do against uh everything and then for that to happen oh my goodness that's just wonderful i'm gonna try balancing between four cameras or two cameras actually see what happens okay there's the sound effect I didn't mean to do that. Was that Oswald? I heard something that sounded like Oswald. Or was that supposed to be like goofy? <sighs> go down, go down, go down, go down. Oh my gosh. I took it if you believe I took it. Have you ever thought of that? Huh? Huh? Have that ever crossed your mind? I only took it if you believe I took it. You just have to believe I took it. Okay, okay. Who's here? Who's here? Who's here? The face. Alright, alright, alright. I still hate the transitioning from the attic to this place because it feels too slow. <sighs> okay, okay. Who's here? face get back down get the notepad get them look for mini right there all right wait for a bit so i can go get daisy okay 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 we're balancing it we're balancing it we're in a we're in a good loop right here we're balancing it We are balancing it. Okay, okay, okay. We're balancing it, guys. There's a good balance between what we're doing. There's Minnie. I'm um, some part of me kind of wants to save the camera flash until she actually like gets to the the camera four, I think, right? Yep. There she goes. Wait for a bit. Get to the attic, see who it is. It's the intruder, it's the intruder. Get down, get down, okay? And we're out of here. All right, get, get these two. Find Mini. I don't see Mini, actually. Is she here somewhere? Am I just not looking correctly? Where'd she go? Seriously, where did she go? Oh my gosh, I can't deal with you guys right now. Alright, look for Minnie. New objective, look for Minnie. Or did I- wait, was that her? In the back? I just realized. Alright, you know what? I liked you guys locked right there. Seems like a safe spot. 
So that was Minnie. She was hiding in the, uh... The... One of, uh, I didn't even know she can intrude in a completely different area, or what is it? Intruder, see, intruder, get down, get down. Okay, okay, okay. So I have to look really carefully now. Because I didn't even know she could get that, uh, to the other route. What? Oh, no. Hey. Hey. I'm so paranoid. Where is he? You're serious? Bro, go back here. Here? Oh my gosh! And I have to deal with the notepad too! Come on, flip off! Ah! Go back! Ah! Where's me? Gosh darn it! <laughs> this is so horrible. Oh my goodness. Oh jeez, dude. Do I continue? Very good question. Do I continue? Hammer back. <sighs> Tunnels is easy, apparently. If you just. Apparently, you can't use your lights. Yo! <laughs> what are you doing looking at it? What even is that thing? <gasps> Did we just let that thing on fire? No. 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 What did you do? They were children. My children. I took them under my care. Is that I protected the them. abandoned Discovery they Island's god? to you people until you. They didn't know why you were doing anything to them. They didn't even understand what you wanted. They were scared. Where are I? Really? They were scared as they were chasing me down. I come here. I shouldn't have let you. I've seen what you people do before. Everything that you do here. Every time your team meddles in something they can't understand. Every time they push and prod. You don't even realize that the grass you step on, the air you breathe. Really now? It's all me. I've always been here. So sh she is gone. Single time. Even if you didn't realize it. Even if you didn't recognize me. I have been here forever. And I will be here forever. But, even after the countless amount of times I've seen this play out, I spent with you. With me? I never thought you'd go this far. I was wrong to let you pollute this place. To 
walk all over me as long as I did. Oh, does it sound like God? Sounds like whatever you are. Not to do with me. just shoved back into the game she behaves like her children the one with the eyes will come to the, the one with eyes will, co will come to the attic he is not under her control trust your instincts do not get tricked by fake sounds what Where'd she go? I'll end up just like the last one. Do I do that? Oh. What do I do here? Hmm. Very interesting, ma'am. Care to explain? Uh, you use the camera flash, right? Yes, it is. Okay. What? That's what? Ain't no way, brother. And then I gotta find her. Is that... Am I crazy? Does she kind of remind me of, uh... Mick Mick, if that's the name. Mick Mick was a, uh, basically just Mickey Mouse with human eyeballs. But the reason why I say it reminds me of it is because. Uh, what is it? The reason why I say it reminds me of it is because it looks exactly like Mick Mick from the older games. Okay. <sighs> I'm assuming I'm looking out for that sound effect, and then I'm gonna look out for this thing that kind of reminds me of, uh, what's that thing's name from Finance of Candy 3 on Night 6? <sighs> okay. Do I take a- just simply take a picture of it, or...? Am I doing more than just that? Don't tell me I just lost. Oh my gosh, it's all in red, too. That's insane. So, what happens after that night? Okay. We made it 3 a.m. So, do I just only flash it? Because the music... Oh, it just teleports in. Is that what I'm doing? Jeez, this thing forms so fast. Am I just taking pictures of those? Pick pictures of it? Huh. 
How does this work? I don't... It's a little confusing, I'm not gonna lie. Okay... It's going in a bit of a circle. Ish. But, I... Something not too terrible. If the music doesn't work, then I'm assuming we just flash it. Right? Oh, yeah, I think so, I think so. I think... Hopefully, this is the rhythm we're getting into. Keep it right there. Or keep it here. Yeah, that would be cool. Keep it right there. <sighs> okay. Your life is almost over. Whatever you say, ma'am. Where'd it go? Where is it? There it is. Uh, first, can I drag you here? And then go over here. Where is it? Here, here, here. Yeah, going to, oh, ooh, we changed his movement a bit. How friskity briskity he changed the way he was moving for exactly two seconds. Where'd you go? Yeah, here. Okay, maybe when it has eyes, that's when I do the cameras or the flashing. And then, uh, what is it? When it has no eyes. Yeah, I'm figuring you out. That's what I do. Please do not tell me I'm dead. <gasps> oh, so it just transforms into it. Okay. Sure? Oh, the amount of time this thing is eating up away, though. Oh. Erase, 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 erase. There's no eyes. Dude, come on! I tried both methods! Oh, I'm telling you, it's the attic. Just anything that comes in the attic just ruins it. It's, like, it takes forever to get up there, and then it takes forever to get back down, and then... Or it takes forever to get rid of whatever that guy was. Uh, okay. No eyes. Use music box. Eyes. Use the camera flash. Also, the noises, though. Ambiance is crazy! Did she sound like Mickey briefly? Also, that famous iconic line from Mickey Mouse. Or uh, photo negative Mickey, I should say. So would it be better if I kept Mick Mick? Just in camera A? Because it seems like it's teleporting back to camera one. Alright, alright, alright. So it just gets to my attic? So, do I just keep it locked in camera 8 then? So she can just go in the attic apparently? Mick Mick can go in the attic if it felt like it. That's, that's cool I guess, okay. Alright, should transform any second now. Any second. Yep, there we go. Maybe if I just keep doing this, it'll, you know. 
camera. I meant that. Yeah, keep you. All right, I think it just went to my attic. So I'm gonna have to wait for a bit. <sighs> okay, camera. Wait, no, 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 no. Wait. Okay, so what? So both could just be in my attic at the same time? Oh my gosh. So what do I, where do I keep it? Do I keep it in, oh my gosh. It gets to my attic even. I'm wondering if it's because it's in camera eight that it gets to camera nine. And uh, that's why maybe do I keep it in camera five? Because admittedly that may no I can't because if I try then it'll just go straight to my attic. So is that just the part where I have to get lucky? Maybe, I don't know, dude. See, now it's just going to, uh, I wonder if there's a strategy I need to do or something. Maybe like keep it close or something? I don't know. Okay, what if I try locking it in there somehow? The brother is here. Your life is almost over. Please shut up, woman. I don't care. Now it's here. I wonder... I just don't get how it works. See, now it's in my attic and it was in camera... I was trying to track it to camera 7. I don't get it. How does it move? Or do I look for that thing and then I can... Do it. I don't know. I don't get it. What do I do to make sure it doesn't go in the attic? Okay, I guess don't get attracted to it then. So maybe I don't really have a choice. Maybe it has to go on camera nine. Yep, now it's in my attic. Now it's transforming. in the attic like the little frick that she is right, there we go there we go there we go get her back into position now she's in the attic again okay okay Back in. I didn't mean to use the flash. Or 
are you? Right there, right there, right there, right there. Okay, come on, get out of here. Just leave. I can feel her inching 50 million miles closer. Flash! We are friends now. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. In the attic. In the attic. In the attic. Come on, get back down. Get back here. In the attic. I'm assuming I won. The morning sun has driven them back into darkness. Or not, I guess? Wow, we did it. It is Mick Mick. Oh my gosh, we. What are these characters? I just realized. I just. Past Lisa. Faux negative. Oh. Some of these characters. Hmm. Okay. We did it. <laughs> We beat night five, holy cow. That was an insane night. Annoying, and a just an insy bit unfair, because the whole part where I got teamed up at the attic, but other than that, holy cow. This game was amazing. This game was actually amazing. Clap it up, Team Radiance. As always, as always. I may find the balance of their game a little unfair, but as always, man, their games, I love, I love this game. I was actually a little unsure about how I felt about it at the beginning, but after playing that, my excitement was not disappointed. This game was amazing. The Slender Man. Jeff the Killer, Eyeless Jack the Ki- Wait, what? As I burp to death? Is there extra content I missed? Maybe, I don't know. Well... 
Thank you for playing. Thank you for making this game, Two Radiance. Thank you very much. Oh, I had I had a lot of fun playing this game. Yeah, it was unfair. Again, there were moments where that was unfair, especially with the the whole like shoving you into that one other mini game where you play when you get to second chance to live. But other than that, this game was amazing. I loved it. Also, what is this music? I hope it's not copyrighted. Wow. And that was a Blictus Casa. Oh, of course, there's extras. Annika. Reward for defeating mother. So that. Oh, I thought, it was, I thought her name was God. I could have sworn there was another version of Final Treasure Island where her name was just God. Alright, let's see what the extras are. So I was right about Willy. Actually, I gotta use the restroom real quick. Hold on. BRB. Several days later. Alright, Willy. So I was right. The character's name is Willy. Willie is the poster boy of Obligatus, Obli Casa, and the main tune Jake encounters throughout the main nights. A distorted image of Mickey from Steamboat Willie. Yeah, Willie is based on the main antagonist of Final Stretch Online version 3.0. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, what was it? I remember there was another version of Final Stretch Island. I think it might have been under the name Abandoned Discovery Island. And Willie was just a normal enemy in that game. And, um... What is it? Yeah. Although he received a lukewarm rep, uh, reception from fans due to the circumstances surrounding his addition, Willie would soon become iconic in his own right, with many eager to see the character given a second chance. That's interesting. I have never seen her before. I'm assuming she's supposed to be the... The... Uh, what is it? The thing that attacks you if you don't do the notepad? Um, yeah, Jake must keep her from drawing from completely itself to prevent her from forming in the office. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, there were, there were a lot of characters over here. Daisy, oh my gosh, she's got spider-like legs. What is that? Resembling a uh, Daisy Duck with a set of tentacles uh, protruding from her. She was planned to make an appearance in the 2.0 version of Finance Treasure Island and was also planned for 3.0 before her starting room was removed from the game. Oh, Inkblot Face. So he's slightly, slightly different name. Okay, wait, what's next? So, oh. So, so the face does appear in the thing. Okay. The face returns and Oblictus Casa visibly decayed since his last outing with the new seemingly human parts. He's smarter and more self-aware than the other tunes and is only one during Jake's last night against Mother. Yeah, I'm not sure what the case is, but yeah. <gasps> Yo, look at that thing. This is what I love about Team Radiance. Just the, just the these things they're so disturbing i love them this tune is the photo negative version of Minnie mouse and earlier versions of final stretch on the mini character in the game uh sported the same color scheme as photo negative mickey this change in version 3.0 where they were instead of version of her with the normal color palette which would later evolve into a character of impurity yeah the character we're all familiar with uh that appears in the normal games the photo negative incarnation of the character finally returns in this game ew what the heck oldest uh one of the old disney's oldest characters uh predating even Mickey Mouse himself and often portrayed as his foil. In Phase 2.0 of the development, Pete was planned as a non-canon bonus character and was last thing added before it entered version 3.0. Dippy, what the heck? So that's what that thing is. Uh, black and white tune resembling Goofy, his name references Goofy's original name, Dippy Dog. Unlike the majority of the Casa cast, Dippy was created for and is uh, debuting up, oh, so he's the only character that's like completely new to the series overall. And mother slash Mick Mick. <laughs> yeah, so I was right. That is Mick Mick. And oh my gosh, what is this thing? Oh my gosh! Following Jake's encounter with her in Final Treasure Island, Mother is once again encountered after the burning of Hourglass. Wait, was that what that thing is? 
uh, where she reveals the true s scope and extent of her being and the island before taking a physical form that of Mick Mick. While the mother character is a drastically rewritten and updated version of God. So I was right! It is God! Just different. <laughs> From previous incarnation of Final Stretch Island, Big Mick's role in the franchise was intentionally much smaller. He originates from the 3.0 version of Final Stretch Island, which I've never even seen him, but I know he existed, where he served as a temporary replacement for photo negative Mickey before the addition of Willy, and later once again took the role in version 4.0. Oh my god. Gosh, that's disgusting. After the events of Final Treasure Island, Hourglass escaped the staff building and roamed the island's forests and sewers, slowly decaying. Jake encounters them once again in the ultra doors beneath the island. Wait, so is this? Is this? That thing, that that final boss from Night Six and Finance Treasure Island. Is that what this is telling me? Huh. The shades. Ghosts of the past. The shades are uh, ghastly and nightmarish cr uh, creatures representing the Finance Treasure Island. Cast memories of a period Jake would rather forget. The player must fend them off in a post mortem. The shades were originally planned for version 2.0. Off on Treasure Island, where they would appear after the player turns the power off. Their models were planned to resemble classic creepypasta characters, however, only two of them uh, were ever modeled. These being Shaded Photo Negative Mickey based on himself and Shade Mini based on Jeff the Killer. They were all. Uh, they all have been given drastic and more original redesigns and updated lore for the Obligatus, Obligatus Casa. Ooh. Oh my goodness. What the heck? <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, I'm goofy and I feel like crushing a plushie today. Oh, yeah. I've never seen her before. Nor him. It was only... It was only like these four. I didn't even see these two. What the heck? Jeff. The heck, so he's actually in the game? A creep puzzle was really planned for a bonus. Originally planned for a bonus uh, mode in Final Stretch Island during the 2.0 phase of development. Uh, Jeffrey Hodek is the uh, younger and capped brother of Lewis Hodek. Jeff was mentally abused and, yeah, origin story no one cares about. Slenderman? Where, where are these guys? I didn't even see them the entire game. Said as far back as Egyptian times, the Slenderman is an infamous creature that terrorizes children and young teens around the globe. Reports regarding the creature's appearance and behavior vary. Some claim they see it with a humanoid face. Some say it has a disfigured face with orbs for eyes and exposed gums. And some report that it simply has no face at all. Some stories report that its victims simply vanish with no trace. Others, uh, yeah, Slenderman... Uh, stuff. <gasps> I can only imagine what would happen if I saw that in the middle of the game. Uh, I kind of don't know that much about Smile Dog, so I'm gonna see what this is. Smile Dot JPEG or, J or JPG, I don't know what you want to say, can be traced back to 4chan's X board and various uh, chain mail emails from back in the early 2000s. Apart victims, a pair of victims of the image claim that posted emails. With it attached would often come with a command to spread the word a sentiment uh yeah a sentiment that would be repeated by the subject of the photo which has been dubbed the smile dog and night terrors occurring soon after viewing all victims report that the these terrors soon ceased after they listened to the entity's demands and shared the image online many believe that the dog or the hand accompanying it in the image is demonic all traces of the image in question are wiped from the internet soon after they are published. With all, uh, the only versions of it appearing online being recreations of the image and exaggerated hoax. <laughs> I gotta imagine who was the original guy that posted the image of his dog and some dude just took it and said, 
Eyeless Jack. I don't think I've ever seen Eyeless Jack. Uh, dubbed Eyeless Jack by those who have seen him, this entity is reported but are reported to appear during episodes of sleep paralysis. Victims will often open their eyes to a dark figure leering uh, at them through a mask with empty black eyes leaking a black oily fluid. Ugh. Uh, following posts about the creature appearing online, many took the stories of those who cited it during uh, bouts of sleep paralysis and ran with them, claiming that it was a cannibal who feasted on its victims' uh, kidneys or a victim of a cult ritual. Regardless of the true nature and identity of the creature or whether or not it's even real to begin with is unknown. Oh no. There's hidden characters, I see. An early menu was made in 2020 during the development of Eyeless Fish Eyes on this menu. Oh, so they so this game was already in development long before. Original 6 AM uh, the design was directed from Hotline Mimi and has a military time instead of a standard time. Ooh, that would have been interesting. Mini featuring uh, placeholder assets later reused for the warning screen. Oh, yeah, the yeah. The original tones were planned to look a lot more ambitious than what we ended up going with for the final game. While the graphics were outdated, there was planned to be a door mechanic and fully animated walking controlled by WASD keys. Oh, wow. I would have... That... I would have loved it and hated it at the same time. But... It is supposed to be a minigame, so I guess that explains the simplicity of it, maybe? Before we made any story changes, the shades were originally going to be more nightmarish versions of Shadow Creatures from Finest Trajan 6.0. Jeezums. Look at them. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <gasps> There was a right ear later added to look like an early model of Nightmare Suicide Mouse. Oh my gosh. Before we settled on the maintenance tunnels for post night, we originally planned for Jake to run through the sewers of the island. Hourglass was going to work differently, having more sound based mechanics. This was scrapped because we felt it was underwhelming and it didn't make sense. Early version of Slenderman. As a funny joke, we originally intended Lock Joe to be in, uh, Obligdus Casa as a custom night enemy, however, we felt his spot wasn't fully justified and could be used for more interesting characters. Ooh, I like the carpet. <laughs> you can just see the carpet. It's so weird seeing uh, real life pictures of just this stuff. We originally planned for there to be an extra night that would reskin all the enemies with their unedited original counterparts. This was scrapped because we thought that was unnecessary. This is post. This is a post mortem test room made to see what uh, could potentially look like. Oh, I don't know why, but that looks cool. Early versions of photo negative mini. This original mechanic for the the corruptus was going to feature them entering your office and causing an object to float in the air or glitch. The player would have to click the object before the corruptus kills you. Wait, what the heck is that? Uh, ink blot face. Ooh. <laughs> Ugly. Before the plans were finalized, we originally uh, had some very different UI, mainly different map layout, which featured four bedrooms at the top map. That would have been interesting. I wonder what that would have been about. Uh, originally intended for there to be an art studio inside the attic that the player would have to check. We scrapped this and replaced it with the notepad to make the game less chunky and easier. Huh. Uh, a sketch of Sadie slowly fades in overtime. You have to hold space bar to make her fade back. Well, I'm glad they didn't include that because <laughs> what I going through the attic constantly was annoying. Early versions of Willy. Various singing concepts. Oh, I remember that thing. That thing was that weird thing that killed you when you were hiding under the desk for too long in an abandoned Discovery Island. I never understood what that was about. Wow, these are very sh What is that? What is that? 
What the heck? What are these? Oh my gosh! My goodness. Making hourglass. Oh. I just realized it kind of looks like a gas mask. I didn't read the full gist of it, but there was a creepy pasta called Room Zero, and I think I don't remember what it was about, but and yeah, do something with employees wearing a gas mask that looked like Mickey Mouse. I'm wondering if this has anything to do with that, or if this is a reference to it. That's kind of cool, actually. Uh, jump scares? Well, I I actually have never seen Willy's. I only saw it through the trailer, but other than that, the face. Yeah, I've seen that a couple times. Oh my gosh, would that have been horrifying to see? Oh my. Oh no, wait, I saw that. Because, you know. Oh my gosh. It. Oh, wait. Yeah, I saw that. Because, you know. I don't know. Like, actually, no, I don't think I saw this. It was the other one. It was Mick Mick. That guy. Frick P. Oh my gosh. Mick Mick. The Nightmare Mick-Mick, that admittedly looked really unsettling when I first got jump scared by that. Freaking Mick-Mick in the attic, freaking, that's, I don't care, that's a boo-boo. There are, wait, one, two, three, four, five, one, oh my gosh, there are six. There are six. Why are there six? Why are there six? I can check out the challenge yet? What? I know this video's been going on for too long. I, I gotta see this. What is this about? Really now? You're not serious. It's the tunnels minigame. Brother. Oh no. Seriously? How am I gonna find these? Or do I have to do the chimes thing again where I just wait for the chimes? I did not miss that. I can definitely tell something is different. The ambiance is a little different than how it was uh, before. Gosh! No, that was a page. Give me that. Wait, I could. I could. Brother, so I gotta look for these bloody pages. Oh my gosh. How do you even find these bloody pages? I know I just got four of them, but still. Where the frick am I supposed to go, brother? Can I collect it? Thank you. All right, five pages. It might be best if I don't get cornered. Cause I just realized like there's a chance that could happen. So, you know, as I just get cornered. Has a very interesting noise to it or jump scare sound. It's definitely different than how it was in the original Slenderman 8 pages. Brother! Where is the bloody other page, my? I'm trying to look for me pages with some very strange drawings made by an individual. I can't remember her name, but <laughs> might like that page right there. The turn of 360 strat. I'm out of 360 no scope these pages, I swear to God. 
If I find these pages soon, I'm about to lose it. That'd be pretty cool if you didn't gang up for me right there. Oh, I just saw, what the, now my man is, I mean, yeah, that's his ability, he teleports, I forgot. He likes uh, moving around like a strange hickey picky dookie, you mission macky. Three sixty no scope. Come on, give me the pages, brother. Brother, and we're done. Never mind. That was easy. Piece of cake. I unlocked a new character. Oh, brother. That was his name, Celester. So I have, I unlocked these characters by... The, 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 the thing? The challenges? Or for defeating Sl Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get a lot of stars if that's the case. So, can I actually see? How do I unlock? No, I, I don't think I can. So I beat Slender, man. Boot up the cameras while avoiding Jeff. And erase the drawing before you lose your sanity. Do, do all these involve the tunnels? Oh, right, but I'm just gonna end it right there. I, this, this is a long episode, I know, but uh, yeah, whatever. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, give it a like, share the video, and subscribe to the channel. If you guys want me to do these custom night challenges or whatever, I'll definitely do them because I am I kind of want to try them out. Leave a like. Hope you guys, uh, I hope I'll see you guys. I don't know when. Take care. God bless and have a wonderful rest of your night. Bye, everyone. Take care.